I've been using a Harmony OS PC for three months now, and my work efficiency has improved significantly. I save at least 30 minutes of work time every day. As I became more proficient with the Harmony OS PC, I gradually achieved a state of human AI integration. Today, I need to create a summary of smartphone selling points. Celia quickly provided common smartphone selling points based on my command. This part is both a summary and an outline for the key. I drag the document directly into Celia and input generate a PPT on the selling points of a foldable phone. An outline will appear first, and we can make initial adjustments based on our own ideas. Then we can choose a template and get started. This is the Celia Document Assistant. It's generated immediately. The number of pages generated might be quite large. I usually trim and summarize it. As for the specific content, everyone can then fill in the text in detail. A PPT like this is created very quickly, and with AI Celia, we can customize different content through templated outlines. This is quite special and will also be used frequently in our regular work. At work, I also rely heavily on this physical physical super privacy switch. In fact, we are very confident in the privacy security of the Harmony OS system. Any app wanting to access the photo gallery or files must go through a secure access mechanism. So more often, I turn it on quietly during meetings or multi-person video call. Then I quickly handle some more urgent matters. I'll turn on Celia meeting notes for the entire meeting. The meeting minutes will be transcribed and summarized. And if I have to step out of the meeting, I can directly set keywords. I'll get notifications for important messages. It's useful. Besides that, there are some other time-saving Harmony OS AI features. With a large accumulation of files day after day, Celia's knowledge space allows for quick searches by asking questions. Of course, there are also summaries and compilations of various documents. After Celia processes them, we can further refine them based on practical needs. I believe many friends are considering the ecosystem issue. I'll use a few of my commonly used apps as example. The first is WeChat, which is indispensable for everyone's work and life. From the initial clean WeChat interface to now, features have been gradually added, such as WeChat channels, audio video calls, and the official accounts we like to read. All of these work normally. It can be said that the Harmony OS PC version of WeChat is already quite complete. As for WPS Office, that goes without saying. The toolbar is complete and the AI functions are comprehensive. Let's mention Billy Billy. The ratings on its homepage have a lot of positive reviews. Netizens even say that the Harmony OS version of Billy Billy lives up to the optimization of a major company. The experience is great. It has many and frequent feature updates. You could say, Billy Billy is a complete packet. I have to give it a thumbs up. The software is always fresh and Harmony OS AI is becoming more and more proficient. So for me, the Harmony OS PC gets better and more efficient the more I use it. For friends who often fly in business class or first class, I recommend getting the Huawei MateBook Fold Ultimate Design. Whenever a new watch is released, you can open Watch Home. As a custom Harmony OS app, it has a comprehensive selection of watches, easy photo and text editing, and you can better appreciate the cultural connotation of watches. You can also un fold the large screen to watch the stock market. Using a Harmony OS foldable PC is more impressive and time safe. For example, I like to follow the news and financial reports of major car companies. For the Harmony OS foldable PC, I think the best design is its innovative gesture controls, especially the eight finger tap to bring up the virtual keyboard. At this point, you can easily enter work mode. Even for a virtual keyboard, Huawei's implementation is very refined, including the edge details of the keyboard, key feedback, and the use of the trackpad. It's basically the same as a physical keyboard. It's so realistic, it even has the Huawei logo. You can hold the super large screen for presentations at any time, and you can also split it in two to quickly solve problems. There are also gestures like a three-finger toss to move windows, and a five-finger spread to easily switch window modes. One screen with two sides displayed and managed independently, and you can also perform interactive operations across axes. It's truly a cutting-edge high-tech product. I've had in-depth experience with both PCs for a long time, and I really have to emphasize the smoothness again. Even if I open 20 or 30 apps in a row, they can all be kept in the background. And even then, continuing to operate the PC remains smooth. And a super large Excel file can also be opened in an instant. Such a Harmony OS PC is worth experiencing. Finally, Huawei has indeed shown sincerity in all aspects, and I'm quite satisfied with the long-term experience. Shortcomings, the richness of the ecosystem still needs to be improved. Many detailed features and non-popular software still need time. The market acceptance is not high at present, so some points need to be deducted for the Harmony OS PC. For the Huawei MateBook Fold Ultimate Design, its super innovative form factor brings a high-end experience in various scenarios. It offers both practical and emotional value. Harmony OS PCs really give computers another option.